You know, it's very difficult to determine uh, who's benefiting. I, I can tell you, no one benefits from a terrorist right. act like this. Uh, no one at all. So, uh, uh, again, it would be premature to try to figure out who may have been responsible for this, what their political ideology is. I know there's a lot going on on the Internet, but law enforcement st has to stay focused on the evidence and on the information they have before they draw any conclusions. There really is a lot going on on the Internet. Uh, the hashtag MAGA bomber is uh, trending. Um, and obviously one prominent theory as is that this is uh, the president's uh, superheated uh, rhetoric that has stirred up a, a militant right-wing group or person to, to begin this uh, terrorist campaign against uh, liberal icons and supporters. Uh, but then, Steve, some on the right say that this could be a clever, calculated campaign by leftist radicals. Uh, the uh, self-styled resistance, if you will, designed to portray the president and, and his followers as, as thugs and fascists ahead of the, of the midterms. Um, Dare, dare we speculate about either of these theories or perhaps an alternative third one, that this could be a foreign agent uh, trying to create even more political division during a very tense political climate? Well, one thing I will address uh, is that this idea that President Trump had something to do with inflame someone to do this. That's absolutely unfair and it's not true. In fact, the president came out today and yesterday he came out and said, look, in a bipartisan way, we're going to do everything we could to find this person. People are accountable for their own actions. And that's something that, uh, uh, we're, you know, we're going to have to understand. So this idea that the president's uh, inflamed people is absolutely nonsense. That's number one. Number two, with regard to the person that did this, in my view, it just may be a lone actor, an individual mm -hmm. who is just completely out of their minds uh, trying to create chaos. So that's why I say it's so important. And, and believe me, you're right. It's hard to filter out all of these theories. But right. that's why we've got top-notch law enforcement examining this, investigating this case.